Thank you, Lord, for your everlasting mercy and goodness. Hear our prayers, Lord, and grant your blessing to the class of 2016, that they may be enabled through your grace to perform beyond our expectations. Sanctify them with your spirit according to your will. And you say, as you have brought them to this holy hour under your discipline and teaching, in many ways both secret and open, so lead them in days to come. Amen. 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 in both the preparations of the learners to sit for the examinations, and we are also ready for the administration of the examination. All our security measures are in place. Like we are doing things like we're still in 2010, wherein we don't want any irregularity to take place. We don't want anything to happen as far as the examination papers are concerned. So the security of the papers, and we are not all doing that alone. We are doing, working with SAPS, and this time, they have even added the number of uh, vehicles that are going to escort our papers and the number of uh, police uh, officers. So we believe that uh, if we can follow uh, that plan, nothing will be reported as a uh, bad in Pumalang. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here today in our numbers to pray, to worship, and give praise to God. With these few words, I would like to say you are all welcome in this district of HMZ. When we start with the exam, we start with the registration of examination centers, as I indicated as schools will become examination centers. In our province, we've got 552 of them that we've registered, and 41 of them are independent schools, while 508 are our public institutions, and five are special schools, some are in correctional services. And the candidates have been registered, all of them. We followed all the processes to ensure that all candidates are registered correctly. And these are the statistics of the candidate that I will briefly indicate that the candidates of this year, compared to the 54,980 of last year, this year we have got, when you combine with the part-time candidate, 67,941. But the full-time candidate are 60,825. There is an increase of 5,845 candidates. And out of these 60,000 full-time candidates, 30,000 of them are those that failed grade 11. But we said to them, because you failed for the second time, don't repeat it. Move to grade 12. Maybe you'll be motivated to do better in the next grade. So as far as learners are concerned, they are ready because our teachers taught them throughout the year. And uh, the syllabus, which is the curriculum, has been completed by most of our schools. And now we are doing revisions with our learners. And uh, the centers are ready. The, uh, markers, uh, the invigilators, the chief invigilators, all those are trained and markers are ready in all our 17 centers that are going to use as marking centers and uh, even all the centers where in our candidates are going to be sitting for examinations are ready. We are more than one, it means Jesus Christ himself through the Spirit of God is here and we answer our prayers. We don't only have to cry for our children, but let's cry for the peace of our country. Why? Because these same children are demoralized when they see what is happening in the country. They say, what's the use? What is the use? But if there's peace in our country, then they will have a purpose for life. We thank you for life. We thank you for longevity of life, fullness. We thank you for strength in the journey of life. We thank you for covering us in difficult moments. Thank you for wiping our tears when we carry heavy burdens. In our lives, in our marriages, in our businesses, in our work, in the Department of Education, and also for our country at large. Here are your leaders, Father, in our midst, as your servants, we're stretching our hands towards them, saying, God, we are finite. You are infinite. You are a supreme God. You are a 
a super God. You cannot be compared to any other gods. You alone were never voted for existence. You exist in power. You are El Shaddai. You are God Almighty. Father, we pray right now that your servants will be covered by your grace, covered by your love and your power. And we ask you that by the blood of Jesus Christ, now and forevermore, let the church say amen. amen. You did what you did from 2010 to this day to signify the significance of your faith amen. in Christ Jesus. Amen. And that is why from year to year, we come together here, standing together with him, yeah. saying nothing shall stop the examination. Amen. Nothing shall cause a depreciation in what our children are doing in the education. Amen. But it shall keep on rising, and that's what we have seen. Amen. And it's because of God's presence. Amen. And when Jesus saw their faith, then Jesus began to say, Son, he didn't say sinner. But he said, Son, your sins are forgiven here. Ladies and gentlemen, we all, no matter what your status may be currently, God is not looking at you as a sinner because you were made in the image of God. But the sin that you live in or you are entertaining was brought by the devil in your life. And you have authority when you come to Jesus Christ to overcome by faith your sin. The Bible says this is our victory. And our victory is what? Is faith. Our victory that overcomes the devil, that overcomes the sin nature in us, is our faith in Christ Jesus. Where we are seated, we are happy. When we look at all the feelings and everything, we believe that as Mpumalanga, our results will improve. Father, we call upon a name that no more even one library shall be burned oh. in the high institution of men. Yeah. No more even one building or God shall be gutted. That, oh Lord, there shall be peace all over. Father, I pray in Jesus Christ's name of Nazareth that you will let peace reign as you have let the water rain from above.
blessings are here today. Father God, I pray for each and every child. I'm blessing that child, Heavenly Father, has been cursed perhaps by the teacher or by the neighbor, that nothing good shall come unto you. I'm undoing that, Heavenly Father, to make the mighty name of Jesus.